The art event was a complete success. We had over 125 people show up and uh, we had free food. We had the uh, scraps of art available for people to use. Uh, we had uh, family and friends come around, children, people from Palm Desert Campus. We actually had two entire classes come from Palm Desert Campus. Uh, we also had our mass productions uh, computer group play m original music, original songs. Uh, we also had a bunch of people come out and read poems, spoken word. We also created uh, about 45 pieces of art. It will be au auctioned out in a silent auction in uh, the Garcia Art Center. So everybody that participated was willing and open to donate these pieces to the Garcia uh, art Center in San Bernardino. And this is, of course, to help our uh, Dreamers students and for them to get an emergency fund going. My name is Juan Delgado. I'm a professor here in uh, English, Department of English. I started working with Liliana, who's kind of uh, the main force behind it. And I just partnered with her and we started working together and uh, getting, you know, uh, getting information out, getting people uh, involved who might be going through a difficult time, I think it's important because all, all different kinds of students go through different difficult times. Class issues, you know, uh, uh, Afro-American students wanting more particular courses. So I think it's, it's important that we support our students and we're about our students. If we wouldn't have a university, we didn't have students. And I think if it falls on us when there are students in need, that uh, if we can all help out. You know. I'm a student here on campus. Well, for me, it's, an, it's a way to express, um, you know, feelings that I have or a way to express, you know, like, some things that I'm not able to express um, via, you know, like, words or, like, you know, it's different. Um, I really do like drawing. I like artwork. So I think that this kind of event, you know, help, helps me um, embrace all of that, especially with events that are going on right now. They express how it was difficult for them to come out or their stories about coming out is undocumented because yeah. a lot of them didn't want to talk about it. Yeah. yeah so I think those, those events help them because they, um, they let the community learn about the struggles that are happening, not just one side. They learn about both sides yeah. and the people who are being um, you know, messed with. My name is Brian Condos Gallegos. It's a great thing to have everybody come together and for a good cause. It means awareness, it means bringing it out there. Uh, there's so much bad stigma about immigrants and the whole collective thing that's going on with Trump, uh, the wall, ICE, immigration raids. So it's good to know that there are people here to learn, you know, to better their education, better their lives, just like anybody else. So let them. Uh, and it's sad that we even have to have a safe space, and that's the real problem. And that's, the, that's the world we live in. Uh, we still need these types of events to inoculate the general population and to stop the violent cycle of ignorance. Um, and my message to other young people out there is to get involved, travel, go outside your comfort zone, just get out there and see the world as a different place.